Hey, what's up everyone and welcome back to our general YouTube channel and of course in this video we will see Revolut and Manzo and of course we will decide which one is the best one and of course which one is the best one for your general online use. Both of these are general banks and they are the best for your international travels and of course if you can't decide between any of them I hope this video helps you. Using your normal cards can be really hard and of course very expensive because of foreign transaction fees, poor translations and of course exchange rates adding up. So this kind of technology really helps and of course companies like Revolut and Monzo, like their general point is to give you a, a cheaper way to spend your money and of course lower exchange rates, lower fees and everything. So this video will hopefully show you which one is the best one and which one you should use during your next travel. And of course for this video I will go over the key features such as like obviously exchange rates, pros and cons of using both of those companies for like spending mo your money abroad. So like yeah we'll see how that adds up and how they work, how they operate. Of course for Revolut it starts with like general fees like your card fee, your international transaction fees and everything but the numbers when you look at it is much better than your average bank transaction fees. This also goes for Monzo as well so that's why a deeper comparison is much more needed. As you can see when they're like looked more generally the only differences are actually small differences which comes from Monzo being a UK registered bank account and Revolut more being a personalized company for your personalized spendings. Of course both of these banks doesn't take any monthly account fee from you, both like are free to use actually in that regard, but they both have different subscription accounts you should read more carefully and decide which one is the best for you. Monzo just takes a £5 or £15 account, meanwhile Revolut takes 3, 7, 13 or £15 per month and they differ a lot because one is three dot three pounds and the other is forty five pounds, which is a big difference. Meanwhile, their fee free spending abroad policy is generally, as you can see with Revolut, it's free up to a thousand pounds, which is for some people a lot, for some people not that much. But Monzo doesn't take any charge for the uh, spending abroad fee. Meanwhile, Revolut is free up to a thousand, then up to a 1% fee, which is depending on your, of course, expenses. If you do a low expense, it's like closer to 1%. And if you do a higher, of course, transaction, it's lower. They both have similar ATM withdrawals abroad, which goes over like 200 pounds a month, month outside. So yeah, they work very similarly on that regard. And of course I talked about Monzo not having any fee free spending abroad charges but also Revolut doesn't have any overdraft facility charges so they have good parts. And also if you're a cash using person and if you do like cash deposits a lot Monzo would definitely be the better alternative for you because they accept cash meanwhile Revolut does not. But this is generally the most expensive and of course most important part for us. There, uh, we already talked about the fee-free spending of both charges and ATM withdrawal charges, but the exchange rate is much more important as well. While Revolut uses the interbank exchange rate, Monzo uses the average MasterCard exchange rate. So yeah, you gotta consider which country will you go, which one has better exchange rates, and of course, what type of money and what money currency you will use. So yeah, it basically comes to this. If you are a generally like cash withdrawing or just cash using person and if you use your bank account for that purpose, Monzo might be better. But if you're a generally like card user and you, if you don't like carrying cash, if you like using your card for everything, Revolut comes up with better cashback rewards, better insurances and everything. So yeah, it depends on your card usage and it depends on your money usage. But with this video, as you can see, we already went over the numbers and depending on your money usage style, Revolut or Monzo will come on top. 
And thinking about everything, I hope this video helped you guys and I hope you will be able to take your money in into account more and I hope this video will help you during your next international travel. I hope to see you in the next video. Have a great day and goodbye.